Today's recipe is from this little recipe book I found at the grocery store. It's cherry and coke apple rings. There it is. Now this is actually going to be strawberry and coke apple rings and you'll see why in a minute. First you're going to need to peel and core three apples. These are medium sized apples. And the recipe app, it mentions that they should be Granny Smith or other tart apples. But I'm using uh, Macintosh because that's what I happen to have in the refrigerator at the time when I made this recipe. And once your apples are cored and the seeds removed, you're going to slice them into quarter inch thick rings and then put them in a bowl. And you're going to get some sugar free jello. Now, I couldn't find cherry for some reason at the grocery store, so I'm using strawberry instead. Then you're going to sprinkle one half teaspoon plus one quarter teaspoon of the, of the uh, gelatin powder over top. And then you're going to pour in one third of a cup of Coca-Cola. Then you're going to cover it loosely with wax paper and put it in the microwave and you're going to microwave this on high for five minutes. Now I recommend you use a very large bowl for this and you'll see why in a second. As it's cooking it bubbles quite high and it bubbled over into my microwave so you can see some of the juice there. So use a large bowl. Let it sit for five minutes after you take it out of the microwave. And then you're going to arrange the apple slices on a plate and you can even uh, add a little bit of the juice. If I were to make this again, what I would do is I would probably add almost twice as much of the gelatin powder and I would use a little bit more of the coke as well because they did quite turn out to be as red as they were in the picture there. But it is a very nice light dessert and you can see you can put a little bit of whipped topping as a garnish. Very nice light dessert for summer.